This is something that no, not many people believe that I do in China, but when I'm in this place, I do. And it's the best feeling ever. Drinking uh, water from the river is the best feeling ever, I think. I think I see a little fish. So let's see. Yep. It wasn't the fish I saw, but it's fish. Nice. Those fish, they love this spent fight. Beautiful the fish. I just had a fish, so the fly is all slimed up. I'm gonna rinse it, rinse it as much as I can to remove the slime. Now I'll take tissue paper and use it instead of uh, Amadou or whatever you guys are using. And it fluffs up, fluffs up the fly pretty well. takes all the mo moisture away, which is good. Almost as good as new. I'll protect tip it now. And I'll apply some potent. That's it. Let's go and get another one. Another pretty spot. Opa! Third cast. It's a small, but small fish, but it's okay. Thank you, fishy. Oh, ah, this one was big, bigger. Never mind, there's probably more. I see what's hiding under the foam. Ah, again. I think I, can, I have a chance behind the bull in front of the boulder. Yeah, I missed the fish. Okay, let's check out over there. Yes, nice. Not a big fish, but nice strike. I mean, still nice bend in one or two, one, two weight rod. Thank you. There was a rise over there. Yep. Small one. Small ones are in those uh, slow waters and, and the bigger ones are in faster waters and around cover. Which makes sense because around cover they can find food, they can find shelter, so, yeah. See above.
that should give a fish that's a good spot yep that's it As I was saying before, they love to go under the rocks and they, they find those cracks, they go inside, they hide and you cannot pull them out even with your hands. It happened to me yesterday. Thank you little fishy. Ah, there was a fish rising and I saw two of them now. Okay, let's see. Yeah, that's it. Come down, come down. Yeah, that's it. Good. Such beautiful creature. If they're naughty and they're moving too much, wiggling, usually flipping them upside down will help. Like so. Thank you, Fishy. Okay. Now it's very shallow here, so if there is a trout, it's probably a very small one. But up there, it's a bit deeper. So it can have some normal sized fish. I'll give it like two, three casts and then move forward and so on. So fast fishing. The more I go upstream, the smaller the fish are, which is normal, but it's super fun. I deliberately did that because it's just more action. Downstream, I got some decent fish, but the, 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 the way they take the fly is like super, super delicate. And I missed 70% of my fish downstream. forward okay up so slower water on the left like this and a little bit more to the right like this and then in the main current Okay, in the main part current there is a red boulder underneath, so that's the place where I expect it, yep. Small but predictable. Opa! using boulder as a cover and then to put your line over over the top of it just to slow down everything because of the current in between is very nice and convenient way to prevent drag drag oh. this micro spot looks very nice It is nice. Good. Fell off. I just love those micro locations. Even this one.
There was a fish. I hope you didn't see me. Yep. Ah, da, 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 da. There is a fish, not a big one, between these two boulders and uh, there is a branch in front of it, so you just go low behind this and cast this fish. There are a couple of more in between, but they're not worth casting, they're too small. See if I have space behind. Ah. Not this one. A little bit more to the front. Okay. Yep, that should work. No. Okay, look at it. Yep, this is okay. Ah, I missed it. Completely opposite side against the far bank. Okay, fish. Okay, let's try to repeat. And wait. Opa! Nice. Not the big one, but a nice strike. Very, very vicious strike. Yeah.